So I can order anything I want for this test? No. You will be ordering one hamburger and one taco. A la carte. I just want a chili dog. Good thing we didn't ask what you wanted. Now make the phone call and place the order. Hang up the phone. I'm just placing the call like you asked. Hello. You've reached the customer service help desk for the company. My name is Tiffany. How may I help you today? You don't sell chili dogs, do you? Excuse me? Hang up the phone. I think you gave me the wrong number, Doc. You need to be holding the menu while you place the call to reach the service number for SCP-971. Without the menu, the number dials the software company help desk you just called. Well, it's not like that was intuitive or anything. Maybe if it didn't withhold so much information, I would have done it right the first time. Just place the call holding the menu this time. You remember the card number we gave you, correct? Yeah, I remember. Thank you for calling Quick and Ready Meals. When you are ready to order, please type in the item codes indicated on our menu for each item you would like to order. I said no chili dog. Please input your credit card number for payment processing. It's pretty cheap for a taco and burger. The prices are always lower compared to other local fast food chains. I bet adding a chili dog wouldn't have been that much more. The money wasn't the issue. So now what? You wait. About 20 minutes usually. Jeez, it, it didn't even make a sound. Don't touch the bag, D9085. Not yet. this after watching that? Why was he in a hazmat suit? What's the catch here? No catch. Other test subjects have said the food is quite good. Better than the food UD class are normally given. That doesn't exactly set the bar very high. Hey, that's actually pretty good. Sir, the lab results are back. Okay, let me see. Lab results? 
from the meat samples you just took? Indeed. Interesting results this time. Interesting how? Looks like the meat this time is positive for monk seal DNA. What now? Each time, the meat comes from an animal on the endangered species list. We're not sure how or why, but this is the case. This is why we limit the use of SCP-971. Monk seal is a new one, though. Monk seal, huh? Not bad. <laughs> Better than the cheetah meat we keep getting, I imagine. Ugh. I agree with the other D-class. That stuff has some crust on it. I just can't get past. You may return to your cell now to await your next assignment. Your escort is waiting for you in the hall. Not quite, Doc. You seem to have overlooked something. Overlooked something? This test. This is my 100th SCP encounter. It's time for you to hold up your end of the deal and give me my freedom. God knows I've earned it. Ah, yes, of course. 100 tests completed. Very well. You will be taken to one of our processing rooms in preparation for your release. Just like that? Just like that. Well then. Excellent. Excellent. I can't say it's been a pleasure, and I definitely won't be missing you. So how exactly does this exit processing work? I'm so sorry, man. What? What the hell was that? Keep your voice down, dumbass. They ordered me to wipe your memory. <sighs> My memory? I don't understand. They were processing me for release. Man, you didn't really believe they were just going to let you walk away. Did you? I've seen D-Class walking here all the time. After only just a month. Much less time than me. That's just what they say to keep you all in line. No, I know it's true. I've seen D-Class walk out of here. Dead man walking, Omar. Every single one you thought was released was promptly terminated and disposed of. Standard protocol. No. It can't be. It was one thing having us die in those tests, but slaughtering us like animals? So why am I still here? If what you're telling me is true, then why not just terminate me like the others? Why keep me around this long? Truthfully, I don't know. All I know is that there's some reason why they want to keep you around. But I don't know what that reason is. So they just wipe your memory instead of terminating you. Wait, you said you wiped my memory. If that's true, then why do I remember everything? I said I was ordered to wipe your memory. I didn't, though. You're not a bad guy, Omar. I don't know what you did to wind up in here, but I know a good soul when I see one. I feel you deserve to know the truth. If you didn't hit me with the amnestics, then what was the whole deal with that spray fiasco? Dude, they were watching me. On those camera monitors. I had to make it look like I wiped your memory, or I'd be a dead man for disobeying direct orders. With that being said, you can't let anyone know that you remember, or it'll be both of our asses. What am I even supposed to do with this knowledge? What's the point of doing any of this if there's no light at the end of the tunnel? Man, I don't have the answers for you. I wish I did, but I don't. I just thought you deserved to know the truth. Well, maybe it would have been better if you wiped my memory clean. Well, the option's always there, I suppose. Think about it and let me know.